We're in Aberdeen Airport, we are just queuing up to get on the plane but we are in the airport, we're going to fly to London Once we get to London, we'll be back on here and I'm going to film the whole thing because it's going to be fucking mental to have the privilege of talking next to Mr. Paul Moore I look. I've arrived in London, I have my friend here! Woohoo! First time! Thanks for coming! Welcome! Me. Thank you! I've just arrived at the hotel, going in my room I love going into a new room. Oh my god, you see my face. I love going into a new room. Is it? Oh. oh my god, I love it. Oh my god, it's so cute. <laughs> I just love it. A little cozy bed, a little shower, a little cool green chair. I love it. I do like London already. I love it. Okay guys, we're just getting ready for the bake moment. My eyes are still really sore. I haven't put mascara on yet. I look so weird. Whatever. The choice of outfit. Jeans. Blazer, who dis? A little bit nervous. A little bit nervous. I've not had my tinny yet, so once I've had that, I'll be fucking wired. Okay guys, just, just act like natural. <laughs> okay, we're having breakfast. I've got some of my unstoppable friends here. Yes. How are you feeling, ladies? Awesome. Awesome. What are you most excited for? Your talk. Yes! <laughs> yes, I knew it! I'm coming through! Woo, we're in the whirly thing! Woohoo! Yes, there's Kath! Hello, Kath! Woo! I'm unstoppable! Yes! Hi! Hey! Just little treats! Love an unstoppable planner. This is how I got my shit done, people. Leslie Mort. Hi, Leslie. What? Hi. Yeah, how are you? I'm great. How are you feeling? Yeah, fuck it. I'm so excited. Oh my god, I'm absolutely buzzing. Are we doing Proud, Proud Mary again? Well, I didn't know if I could have time because nobody actually responded to me. I wanted, I wanted to sing it, but I'm feeling like if there's time. Definitely. I just been Curious as fuck, yeah. I almost said that other thing. Because <laughs> rhythm is When you're not filming your journal in the morning, what are you doing? Looking at your phone. Here's where I'm at with this. We're on a lunch break. Look, we get fucking spoiled, man. After this, it's my time. It's my debut. <laughs> Absolutely buzzing. Can't wait. Not nervous yet. On the tinny. Get the energy up, obviously. Full sugar, sugar full. Getting it done. I'm gonna record everything and share it with you. Me, they gave me someone's phone to record someone to get a jiu-jitsu strike and I thought it was my photos. Oh, <laughs> oh no! Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. sorry. Hey, 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 guys. On your feet, on your feet, let's go! Buzzing. I've had three tinnies, <laughs> so I've, I'm ready. I want to go back to July 2021, the day I shit myself in public. <laughs> Welcome to the club. <laughs> so here's me at Scotland's Strongest Woman 2021. Unexpectedly, as I was humping the bar. <laughs> There was a shit, okay? Because at the end of the day, shit happens and you just have to fucking get on with it and get the rep. Can everybody raise their hand if they've ever achieved something or tried to achieve something or plan to do something to make somebody else proud? And that was the moment that changed my life. So I'm No matter what I did, I was not going to be enough. So that was the day I just gave up. And I did not stop, no matter how heavy it was, no matter how heavy it felt, until I got to the finish line. What do these stories have in common? What do these moments and events in my life have in common? Were things I never thought 
possible. Things I never ever, ever thought I could do. But with focus on the finish line, staying determined and taking action will lead you also to realize your limitless potential. Okay guys, so I finished my talk, which was amazing. But we are, we decided, well I decided, I was um, taking full advantage of being in London, so I have, first of all, had the fucking most amazing Uber driver, Sharif, he was fucking so cool. Um, but we are at Buckingham Palace. <gasps> I was absolutely shit myself for coming, because I was like, oh my God, London's so busy and I'm gonna freak out and somebody might murder me and kill me. But I was like, get a grip and come, and look, oh, it's absolutely stunning, look. Oh, I feel a bit overwhelmed. It's amazing. I just love this so much. I love this. This thing is pretty fucking spectacular. Maybe one day I'll have a statue. <laughs> I'm just going for a walk. I'm going to go walk down to um, Parliament Square and then just look at these guys. Look at these guys just chilling there. Look how cool they are. Just chilling in a duck. By the way, the pigeons here are fucking brutal. Just fucking fly right into your face. The psychos. Worse than scurries. But yeah, it's absolutely stunning here. Absolutely stunning. I'm in love with London. I didn't think I'd like it. It's very overwhelming. It's extremely overwhelming. It's a bit like, whoa, it's a bit nuts, but it's absolutely stunning. I didn't think it would be as bonny as this, and I absolutely love it. I just love it, and I'm very overwhelmed by it in a good way. It's a bit scary when you're not used to it, but it's so good. And these guys are the way to dance, so 